Hey guys, I hope you're well. We're gonna make the most delicious Mediterranean inspired fish stew. Couscous, tomatoes, lemon, olives, parsley. It's so quick and easy and I think you're gonna love it. My family absolutely love it. So let's do this. Pan, medium high heat. I've got two beautiful salmon fillets here and this is so good for us. It's been pin boned, but we've got the skin on as well. I'll just add a tiny bit of olive oil and a little bit of seasoning and we'll start to cook this skin side down for two or three minutes and it's gonna go really crispy, like a crackling and get nice and golden. So, couscous. I think couscous, if you've never had it, is a brilliant thing to have at home. It's like a nice carb that you can do very, very quickly. It's quicker than rice. Get a bowl and you want about 150 grams. All you have to do is pour boiling water over the top and give it about a centimeter on top. We can give it a little bit of olive oil like that. And actually we can flavor it with many things, herbs. I actually like to use lemon zest. And that little bit of lemon zest will give it a freshness that will really cut through the fish later on. Put a lid on top. It's just gonna swell up and steam and be light and delicious. So look, this is at a couple of minutes. You can see what the heat of the pan is doing to the fish. You can see where it's changing color here. That's where it's cooking the fish. So once it's got nice and crispy, just use some tongs to turn it over. See how crispy that skin looks, absolutely amazing. And I just wanna fry it for one minute, not even that. So, while that's just doing that little bit of cooking, I'm gonna slice up two cloves of garlic, then remove the fish just for a second. That fish is half cooked, which is great. That's what we want at the moment. We're gonna go into the pan with the garlic. I'm gonna take a little handful of olives. Then I'm gonna finely slice the courgettes. Go as fine as you can, get it into your pan. So let these fry off for a couple of minutes to get a little bit of color, soften up and become delicious. So what we can add is a little bit of herb. I'm using parsley. Give it a little wash. Finely slice the stalks. The stalks are really sweet and delicious. And then I'll kind of roughly chop the leaves like that. Really fresh and delicious. As we start to get a little bit of color on the courgettes here, we can turn it into our stew. Now, what I like to do is just crush the tomatoes in my hand. Of course, you can use a passata if you want, but you'll get better flavor from a whole tomato. So I break that up and put it over my shirt. It always happens, don't worry. And then with this empty tin, I'm just gonna put some cold water in there, about half a tin, and I pour that straight in there. We'll cook that out for like five minutes. Now look, the great thing I love about this one pot wonder, this fish stew, is you can make it your own, right? I'm gonna give you the basic recipe, but like I'm using salmon, you know, if you were in Morocco or Spain, they'd never use that. It'll be local fish, white fish, prawns, you know, mussels, clams. You can really go to town and put a mixture in there, but also on the veggies, a little handful of peas, broad beans, a little asparagus. You can have fun with this. And in this dish, you've already got two of your five fruit and veg a day. So as this comes up to the boil, I'm gonna go back in with these salmon fillets here. Place this in to this sauce, right? Turn it right down. Just have a little squeeze of lemon juice. Lid goes on top. About five minutes of gentle cooking is gonna allow the salmon to absorb that flavor and also flavor the sauce. And then I'll show you how to plate it up. You're gonna love it. So five minutes later, it's all done. It's that easy. I've turned the heat off actually, and it's quite nice sometimes just to kind of let it rest. So look, let me serve some up. The couscous is cool. Fork it up. Really, really nice. Have a little look at this. Gorgeous, oh, it smells absolutely amazing. Take some of this sauce. The salmon goes on top like that. So look at that. So I've got the olives, a little bit of parsley on top. And then one thing I love to have with this, is a little bit of yogurt. It works so well, just makes it heavenly. So there you go, that is a really simple recipe. My Mediterranean inspired fish stew with couscous, tomatoes, olives, lemon, parsley, come on. Let's get in there. Wow. Mmm. Mmm.